Hey there guys, this is version 2, welcome to Let's Play Super Smash Bros. Brawl, the subspace episode. This was originally going to be a co-op Let's Play, but it was just too damn difficult to co-op. So I, I'm doing it by my little lonesome, and the fact that the other player sucked. No offense, Michael. And now we are into it with my awesome name of V2, because version 2 doesn't fit. And I'm doing hard, because I suck at Brawl. And dramatic opening sequence starts. Grabs cheering for me, even though I'm not even on the stadium. In here, first introduction. Zelda and Peach. Hard tap at At the same time. Both of them. In here we have Mario. And Kirby. Epic fight between Kirby and Mario is the first thing of the game. Horses and a Mario because Mario is awesome and he was the thing that the curse was started from. So I didn't have to press left or right because I'm lazy. Now look, like, it's one thing about subsets from emissary. I say emissary, but people I've heard some people say emissary. But I say emissary. Yeah. yeah. Whatever, I, I completely forgot what I was going to say, whatever. Yeah, you have three lives to do this. And Kirby's firing his laser. And I can't replace it with my cape because my life depended on it. Yeah, see how much I suck with this? Normally he should be dead by now. Yes, I reflected something. And it did jackal. Yeah, no, I haven't gotten 100% in this game before. I think about like 98, 99, I can't remember. Maybe 97. But whatever. And up. Oh, yeah, damn it. So close to it. Yeah, it's not so similar, sorry. It was, it, it's good for an adventure mode. It definitely is improving. And if there's one thing you must do, try not pay attention to the storyline. Yeah! Kick your ass. The storyline is quite complicated. I understand it, but that's only because I'm a nerd and I research it and yeah. I mean, there's still parts that just make no sense, but whatever. I understand it as much as you possibly can. It's a bit hard to understand something that doesn't make sense. And we have Pip perving on us. And it's obviously lagging because he's watching the fight after I've killed Kirby. Pit, update your internet. Stop using dialogue. And Mario brings back Kirby to life. Whatever. Um, grab my hammer. Smack me in the face now. When you look at those clouds, apparently there's pictures of like bosses that appear later. And it's Meta Knight shit. And it's giving everyone a toe nose. Here we have Primits. One of the main enemies. Oh, one of the main enemies. And the two princesses come down, actually getting off their lazy asses and doing something for once instead of being kidnapped. I'll use Mario, then Kirby, then Zelda, then Peach. Because that's the ranking of awesomeness. And this works differently from normal as if you don't know. You have a normal damage percentage and you get some flying and that's how you die. But your enemies just have a st stamina bar. You can still send them flying off the stage off the stage to kill them. A few of them. So you don't have to actually kill them all the damage. The, you've got multiple kinds of enemies. These ones down here, the little bastard weird looking guys are firing this guy. Wait, no, that's not and those little perfect guys, multiple variations of them. Mario's dead. Got those spats. They're annoying as hell. Try to wait to attack one, they turn black. And they go, I'm gonna bust a cap in your ass. I didn't mean to be racist, it just sort of came to me. And they do like massive like shots. Shots, and I hate them. And the basic pyramids, most of them are easy to kill. The boomerang ones are a bit annoying because, well, the trim rank tends to be fun. That little gulp in there is a trophy stand. You throw it at enemy, 
Once there's a low enough damage, and voila, better than a I'm unbelievably lazy, so I won't do that for every enemy, but I will show you getting that for like bosses, for some bosses, like etc, etc, etc. Enemies that I feel have been the worst. Oh! Spam! And they're all dead! And because I'm using the Wiimote on its side, I have, and I'm using the V2 name, I've got the controls switched around differently. The Ancient Minister, the Leader, or at least the King. Two Rob's coming out of nowhere. They penetrate it and they open it up. And oh my god, it's a bomb. With a three minute timer, which makes no sense as there is no time for the boss fight that's about to appear. And now it's the biggest day saving to my life. And somehow, Pete Piranha, spoilers of Pete Piranha, shoots a cannonball at Mario and owns him. And these two get kidnapped. Surprise. And Pete Piranha's breast. What you gotta do here is attack the cages and to one of them three. Whoever you free is who you'll be using. Note, you only use them for like one to two levels, so it really makes a jackal difference. As the, as the person that you save gets kidnapped anyway because she is a bitch regardless of what you save. I'm gonna save Zelda because, well, Peach has been saved enough times, she freaking deserves it. And my backfire. But I can still kill Peach Piranha. Oh, and he's already dead! But and remain dead sequence. Yay! I killed you, you bastard. And he explodes. And Warrior comes out of nowhere with a massive gun, <laughs> giving her evil love. Stares at Peach because he's a perv, and then. I'm a charge in my laser. Soup the whoop. It, that's like a dark cannon or something. Instantly tropifies people with an arrow. And Warrior has one hell of a jump one. Did you see that? And he jumps out of the stage. But what, run after him. Oh, wait a minute. There's a bomb here. What the fuck? And oops, I died. Oh no, they escaped. Damn it. Why'd they have to escape? How did they know that was a bomb? It could have been like candy or something. And look at my mass amount of stickers. A whole like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight stickers or something. I probably have all of them already, but whatever. But look at that, I'm in their glory. Kirby, who's joined your team? Nice to know. So was Zelda, even though Zelda gets to that later. And let's say 97%, let's say we're having that one. Because I don't know why I had that game. And time for, and let's save again. And again. And again. Save overload. Ah. I want to make sure that this game is saved. Anyway, that's the end of this video, so I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play The Subspace Emissary. Ah.